Hey YouTube, just a quick uh, EDC pencil review here for you. Um, I've been kind of looking for, um, you know, another option for an EDC pencil. I've been carrying the Midori Brass quite a bit, but um, I've been kind of researching these Coecos, and uh, I decided to pick one up, and I, I think it's, uh, so far, I've been really pleased with it. Um, this is the Coeco Sport. Let's see if I can get that to focus here. Um, this one is in the 0.7 mill millimeter lead which is a pretty standard size. Um, I really like it so far. It's uh, kind of chunky, kind of beefy. Um, it's got the Coeco logo there on the back. If it'll... Probably not going to focus there. But anyhow, it's uh, pretty thick, pretty beefy, but really light. It's uh, just a type of plastic. Um, but it's really got a nice feel to it. It writes really well, even though it's small. Um, it's got a real nice feel to it. Um, when you put it in your pocket, you don't really notice it much because it's so light, even though it's pretty thick. Um, and because it's a little bit thicker, I don't worry as much about it, you know, falling out of my pocket. Like when I when I carry my Fisher Space Pen, um, you know, I worry about losing it because it's so thin that it's easy to slide out of your pocket. Um, I I thought when I got it, it might come with a clip, but it did not. Um, so I just recently ordered a clip, um, which I'm going to try out and see how I like that. But so far I've been enjoying just carrying it, just dropping it down in my pocket. Um, my left hand pocket just sits right next to my cell phone and I don't even notice it's there. So um, I really like it. I like having a mechanical pencil. Um, one con is this does not have an eraser. Um, so you can't erase your mistakes unless you want to carry a little eraser, but I just I haven't found it to be a problem so far. I just scratch out if I need to or uh, you know most of the time I've had an eraser around I could get I could get at, but that's definitely one uh, negative in my mind. Um, another negative is kind of, is the cost. They're pretty expensive. This one was this was twenty six bucks, I think, um, and I believe that's quite a bit less than even the, what their suggested retail price is. But the one I really liked was they do the same pencil in brass, but it's like sixty seventy dollars. It's up there, so um, I opted to get the cheaper one. But I like it so much, I may end up getting the brass one down the road. But um, yeah, I like it a lot, guys. It's light, um, kind of chunky. Um, it's really not very long which I kind of thought might be an issue for me. I've got pretty big hands, but um, I really like it. It's really a good fit. Like I said, it writes really nice. Um, 0.7 lead is easy to find, cheap. Um, it's pretty easy to change the lead out. So anyway, I, I really enjoy it so far. Um, if you haven't checked out the Coeco, I'd encourage you to do your own research. They have lots of different models. They have pens as well. Um, but I'm really happy with this Coeco pencil so far. I'm going to give it a shot for a while and it may become my new EDC pencil. So, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Take care. God bless.